story of a young man who was just starting out in a very promising life until something suddenly went very wrong. And now his parents, they've had to drastically change their hopes and dreams for his future. Andrew Ochoa, the kind of young man any parent would be proud of. Handsome, smart, a star receiver for Verado High School's football team. He got an academic scholarship to junior college and was working on playing football at the next level. Just about everything was going Andrew's way until October 14th of last year. Traumatic. Just, I mean, he's my boy, you know. I worked so hard with him to get where he was been. You know, we're a family that comes from sports in our life. All his friends are sports. Sports is all they do. Andrew was out having coffee at Dutch Brooks with some buddies when he got a terrible headache. It turned out to be bleeding on his brain, some sort of hemorrhage. And now... Can you turn your head over here, Andrew? Andrew, can you turn your head, son? Andrew's brain trauma is so severe, he doesn't have use of his limbs. He can't speak. He needs constant care. Stretch out your fingers in your hand. Squeeze my hand, Andrew. Can you squeeze it? His parents' dreams for his future changed overnight. I'm a mom of three boys. They all were sports, baseball, football, hockey. I've never felt so close to my kids. I just don't take one day for granted, not one. Sasha Caparimo knew she had to do something to help. So without any experience fundraising at all, she decided to try to put an event together to take some of the financial strain off of Andrew's family. She got donations from all over her Verado area neighborhood, and even donations from Big Valley sports stars. This is the ball that Larry Fitzgerald sent us. He signed it, he mailed it to us, and he wrote a little sticky note and said, I hope this helps with the family with expenses, and good luck, LF. Andrew needs constant care like what he's getting now at the Care Meridian facility in Central Phoenix. His situation, a reminder to all of us that our lives and our futures can change in an instant. One of his friends who visits Andrew several times a week has learned a lesson of his own. You know, he's, he's just sitting there and like he needs the motivation. So when you feel like giving up, he's feeling like giving up. So don't give up on him because he needs the motivation just as much as like as much as we want to quit. That's as much as he wants to quit. But we can't quit because we have to be strong for him in order for him to be strong for himself. So um, <clears throat> just an amazing family, you know and uh, they're going through a lot. So if you would like to help them out and meet Andrew's family, there's the Andrew Ochoa Believe event. It's going to be held at Verado High School tomorrow. And we were out in Verado, and you know how those people are. <laughs> You're going to make me lose it, though, today. Uh, from uh, <clears throat> 10 until 5, there will be food, raffles, auctions. So again, Verado High School from 10 until 5 tomorrow, and we will be right back. encourage you to go out there.